Alright, this one was pretty interesting. Uh, it's on a Python script that will, um, you know, it'll minimize all the open applications besides the active one that you're looking at. So this feature is, reminds me of the um, the arrow shake feature. You know how you shake the stupid window <laughs> and everything else uh, minimizes except for the one that you're shaking or the one that is active. Um, so that's what we're going to do, okay? And let me demonstrate this out. Let me open some applications here. So let's open, let's say VLC. Let's open the totem. Let's open the terminal. Let's open GP rename. Um, yeah, I think that's about it for applications. And um, let me put this aside first. All right, so you see that they have four applications here, right? Uh, no denying that. And if I wanted to um, minimize the the rest of the other ones that I don't want, um, and only have like maybe my movie player open. So in, in Windows Seven, you you know you shake the stupid thing, right? In here, um, you can't do the shaking, but you can do like a hot key or something like that, or maybe a hot corner. So for example, if I do this. It'll minimize everything else except for the active one. Now this script doesn't actually restore the, the you know, the applications uh, that was minimized. But uh, hopefully someone that, that's good at Python scripts can actually do that. But you can see that you can use the high corners like I did before, or you can use the hot key. So let me show you an example here, All right? And it'll do that. Um, so it's basically just a script. You need Python install. Um, you know, it should come by default on all their, uh, the Linux distribution. If not, just go ahead and install it in your uh, repositories. So anyways, let me show you um, what you need to do. So the script is... Oops, let me do... Uh, in here, okay, there you go. Uh, basically, you want to, you know, just copy-paste it in here into your uh, your text editor. And save it as uh, the arrow shake dot py or whatever you want to call it. I call it arrow shake because that's why it reminds me of. Um, and you want to do is go to properties and uh, allow executing. Okay, make sure you do that. Um, and then after that, um, it, it depends if you want to use compass with this or not. But you don't have to. You can always use the keyboard shortcuts. And basically, you want to go down here and add. Right, you add one of this stucker. But uh, this is what I added right here. And you just point it to your script. So you go blah blah blah, and your script. Okay, and that's it. That's all you gotta do. If you want to use compass for this, and use a hot corner button binding, you can use the commands uh, plugin. And basically, you point it to your script. Uh, where, where is it at? All right, and I I use the button binding. So my button binding was this one, and I use button one and the location of the corner, and that's all you gotta do. So now whenever you want to, um, you know, what was that? Uh, do your arrow shake or whatever. You just hit the corner, and everything else will be minimized except for the active window. So uh, it's almost completed, but you know there's no restore option. If someone actually is good at Python and you want to complete it with the restore option of of the other minimized windows, uh, go ahead and modify it and uh, let me know. All right, that's it for this one.